cave entrance. Now we're going after the gnolls. And apparently wormlings. White dragon, white dragon, white dragon, white dragon. So, see how this works. I'm gonna attack the other one. This is too easy. We're all about sneak attacks. This won't work if I don't get to do sneak attacks. Test true power. Oh, shit. Try to kill something! Okay, one down. Need some more sneak attacks in. We need to reduce their number fast. Okay, not bad. Ace true power. Okay. Uh, I think we're okay with this. Just try to do sneak attacks and we're okay. I don't need to attack them in the rear necessarily. It's enough that they're attacking, so focusing on someone else. It's better that they attack me with the break attack, so I, I'm pretty much immune to them. Reflex save plus 9, and it has a difficulty class of 12. So, only need to get a 3 to successfully evade it. Okay. Gloves of Minstrel. Perform plus three. Useful in any way. Red dragon. Um. Now just wait right there it done. and don't or rather wormlings until I say. See if we can <laughs> get a few of them at a time. All right, crew. Let's take them down. Again, I'll be pretty much immune to their uh, breath attack, so I'm... No, this won't work. I, I won't survive their physical attack. Well, if there's more of them, we're not going to survive them. Yeah, two more. Ah, we need to rest up. Could be worth this. It's not exactly hard, but Dragon Hatchery. This experience is always worthwhile. Now just wait right there and don't this is too easy. Alright crew, let's take them down. Ok, 
Okay, I'm gonna need some hits, guys. Piece of fuck. Uh, this won't really work. I need that sneak attack hit, please. That's the top. This is too yeah, Zanos easy. is going down too, so critical hit, sneak attack. One more hit and it'll go down. We're not too good at this. The major problem is that uh, every even half decent enemy we're facing at this point has two attacks per turn and I have one. It, an extra attack later on doesn't matter All that right, much, crew. but when you down. only have one then it feels, then you feel, really feel it, because you, that's combined with a low Usually low armor class, low amount of uh, hit points, and so having half the attacks the enemy has is not not exactly healthy at that point. Heavy blade could be a very useful martial weapon. Good damage uh, in uh, decent critical threat range. Dragon Age. This is a dragon egg found in a cave full of wormlings. Such eggs are often highly sought after by wizards and other arcanists. Arch Didn't I give the finger to the red wizard? That'll mean I can't get rid of it. So yeah, this is a pretty worthless place to come to visit. Now the shield is more valuable. I'm still I don't want to get rid of the heavy flail quite yet. Sometimes you need to just focus on attack. Other way. Dignol Caves. Yeah, this looks like a fairly sizable site. Sleepy warrior. So alarm gongs, that's what it looks like. Yeah, this is a fairly sizable place. Wonder if I can get rid of the gongs. Intruders. Uh. 
Holy shit. What the fuck happened? Yeah, hit, 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 hit. And I also took a critical hit there somewhere. Yeah, I'm dead. What are you doing? Judas. Yeah. I'm sounding the alarm right about now. Can I use the gongs myself? I mean, or can I disable them or something? Might have to redo things to say depending on what my dialogue options are with the gun. Because if I can sabotage them, it makes much more sense for me to just try to sneak through everything on my own and just get rid of them. Really excited to talk. It seems that the Gnolls use this gun to, uh, as an alarm against possible intruders. We can ring it or do nothing. And we destroy it. Actually, that would basically be the same as ringing it, but uh, not with our attacks. I suppose we could lure them out somewhere. They probably are in central areas. So we could lure them out of here and then enter. Something like that. Alternatively, we can just murder all the things. We are getting experience out of them. 31 per enemy. That's not bad. We can buff our armor class a little bit. We need to. I think I have a small shield. Might help a little bit too. Don't have the shield proficiency. What do you want? What do you Or extra armor points? It's not much. <laughs> <clears> hmm. <throat> okay, but again, in a situation like this, it will probably make a huge difference. Because we're reaching armor class values where they need very close to a critical hit to hit us at that point. They're not that great of an enemy. Intruders! This. <laughs> Yeah, not good, not good. Yeah, they're getting their goddamn hits. They're getting fantastic rolls, basically. just need some kind of an area cleared out here so I can rest in the cave system. More healing kits. Gold and some 
crafting equipment, crafting ingredients. Now this this thing just absorbs so much damage. It will take forever to destroy it. All right, crew, let's take them down. All right, crew. Let's take them down. Sneak attack. Choking powder. On your spike trap. Mm, we'll we'll even lick it a level up from this place. And focus needs to be to try to get to shadow gems. But I can't see us making through without too much fuss if we don't go to shadow and amass shadow dancer. This is too fuck, easy. Fuck. No, don't attack. Not yet. Let him take the. This is probably what we were looking for. This is a uh, separate space on the side that we can uh, block the entrance to. So it's basically a secure location in this cave. Cage to sleep. Oh shit. Alright, crew. Let's take them down. This is too easy. Come up with <laughs> you cannot win. Test true power. Test true power. Come on, take it down. Yeah, we're going to hide my things. H key. Albert. Few measly gold pieces. Who are you? Glendir. Ah, you there. I don't know what you're doing here in this case. I'll just thank my stars you're not a no. My name is Glendir. Do you terribly mind letting me out of here? First tell me who you are. I'm Glendir, the oldest son of the Baron of Hilltop. I'm quite valuable, alive at any rate. If you release me, I'm sure my father would reward you well. Yeah. Oh really? The Baron's son, you say? 
Why, yes, I'm sure my father would shower you with gratitude and gold upon my return. A thousand, no, wait, two thousand gold. There's no baron no uh, Baron of Hilltop. There's no such thing. It's just a small village. Mm -hmm. All right, what are you hiding? Do I have to beat it out of you? Uh, no, no, please. No, don't do that. I hate pain. Look, I I, I told the gnolls that so they would think I was worth something as a hostage, so they wouldn't eat me. Can you blame me? Maybe not, but we could still kill you. That would be better than listening to any more of this prattle. The truth is, I don't even have any money. Everything I had was in Blomberg, and now it's gone. My sister is a smith in Hilltop, but she certainly isn't rich. A smith in Hilltop? Uh, yes, her name is Fiona, but I don't know if she would help me out or at all. Does, does this mean I have to stay in the cage? That's probably the truth. So, maybe we can get something out of her. Uh, I have no interest in leaving the guy here, for us. as far as we know, he's done nothing wrong. Hold on, I'll see what I can do. Excellent. You won't regret it, I assure you. Thank you for releasing me. I thought I was never getting out of there. Now, uh, can you show me where the exit is? Fine. Follow me. I really appreciate this. Thank you very much. Mm. Post should be clear. Wait, 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 wait. This is too easy. Please, Glendir, get the fuck out of here. Oh shit. Probably attacking him because he's the easiest target. So, I'm not waiting here anymore. Another patrol might be coming our way and we want to come rescue him. That looks like the exit there. Thank you for saving me. I don't think I would have made it without you. I'm inclined to agree.
animal then? Beast master. All right, crew. Let's take them down. Now just wait right there and don't move a muscle until I say Beast Master's <laughs> horn. This brass horn is less of an instrument and more of a crudely made device intended to make one particular note when blown into. It reeks of fur and stale gnoll saliva. When blown, the horn will make the bears that live in this cave friendly for a time. Consider it done! Well, now we have a team together. Makes things easier for us. Team bear, ready to go. Uh, what exactly do we need to do, though? Dunno. Do not know. Hmm. What is this? Take them down. All right, crew. Let's take them down. Work has to go. Yeah, the wizard can be tough, but the work will uh, guar is guaranteed to kill us. Has good defenses, there's no easy way to take it down. Uh, I'm not gonna survive this. I think he's out of spells though. Lesser summoning dagger plus one. Okay, parchments. These sheets of parchment are all dirty and covered with stains and greasy fingerprints. There are notes in a crude goblin tongue scri scribbled on most of them, with some parts in simple common. Some of the clearer sections read. I have not figured out the correct cantrip to cast on the waters of wisdom yet. 
I'm not sure if each pedestal will release a token or not. Not sure if I want to face the elementals again to find out. The token appears to be used in the central well. I will experiment more one day. Perhaps Grishnak will send an escort with me. Perhaps. Ooh, healing spells and a wand of missiles. This is good. Not that many charges left. Potion of invisibility. Very nice. Ancient tome. These thick tome's pages are yellowed and crumbling from extreme age, and the writing within is quite compact and in a language unfamiliar to you. Numerous notes have been scrawled into its sidebars throughout, most in a strange cobbling tongue, but some in common. Uh, yep. One of the larger notes reads The ruins uncovered below these caves are, in my estimation, none other than Netherese in origin. A remarkable discovery so far outside of the Ana Anarok Desert. I can only surmise that this facility was some form of chaining area for Netherese magic, perhaps remotely located from the main empire. Regardless, it seems it did not escape the destruction of the rest of the Netherese. Most of the scrolls and other magic have been, we have uncovered below have been destroyed or useless. What few good artifacts have been found have been jealously snatched by that damnable sorceress. If she would only tell us what she, she seeks here, this entire process would be much less frustrating. We will send apprentices below again to discover more. Okay, that's worrisome. On the positive side, we have a lot more healing, but yeah, this looks like this is just the first level of a complex, so... <sighs> And we're already pressed at this point. <sighs> I'm not. I just don't know if we have what it takes to go through this. Where are my bears at? Let's go, bears. Okay, bears. Let me just try and assign this somewhere different. It looks like I have to be used. I have to use it constantly. Assuming the bears have fairly specific use here somewhere.
We probably do want to keep those spares alive, no matter what. We can't lose them to crap like this. Slaves. Signals captured all these people, maybe from Bloomberg, or maybe they have range further still. Hmm, maybe. <laughs> slave, 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 slave. No named people. Hail and well met. You, you're Elven. Thank the gods! Please, my lady, please let us out of this place. The gnolls will be the death of us all for sure. Hmm. First, tell me who you are and how you got here. Well, we are from Blomberg, or rather, I should we, we say we were. The gnolls descended on our village not more than a day ago. These four come from Blomberg, eh? Well, maybe they should have defended their village better. We don't know why they came or what they wanted. They, they killed most of us. They're all we're all that's left. Oh, please! Is there no way you could release us? I'm begging you. We will surely die here if we do not escape. Hmm. They're free to go. The way is clear. We... We are? You are sure? Oh, thank you, my lady, thank you. Before we go, we must know. Is the village of Hilltop safe? It's the only settlement near the for this forest, and we can't return to Blomberg now. You have an option to lie or just screw these people over for... I, I don't know what would be the gain. Yes, that's an option still. That's a good idea. Go to Hilltop. You'll be safe there. That's such a relief. Thank the gods. Tell me, lady, might we know the name of our savior? My name is Belaya. Thank you, Belaya. May the gods watch over you always. Yay, the experience. Okay, we're... Less than 1,000 away from a level up. We should make sure that the gnolls don't attack them. No, they don't. They'll just disappear, mystically here. Do I have any healing, more healing potions? No. Oh. Okay. Cannot rest with enemies nearby. You are in a dangerous area. You should find a secure room to rest in. Cancel it. Well, ah shit. Let's just keep on going. I'm going to save the bias in case we have to go. Yeah. It looks like some kind of major chamber up north. Mm -hmm. Oh, fuck, the bear. The bear killed it, so I didn't get any experience. That's, uh... That's no good.
Um, that's sort of a questionable design, in my opinion, because it it encourages you to not uh, rely on allies or make sensible judgment. You you can skip that if you have a system where directly killing someone doesn't earn your experience, which I do like. I have to say, Shadowrun Returns does that one nicely too, because the karma you get points, karma points only when you finish quests or do some actions, but it doesn't matter how you do them. That's the important part. So use allies or don't, it won't make a difference. This guy looks dangerous, it has a skite, so it, on a critical hit it'll instant, pretty much insta-kill anyone. Alright crew. Let's take them down. Yep, let's. These are kobolds in these cages as well. The gnolls seem to have captured them. Yeah. Alright, crew. Let's take them down. <laughs> Gnoll chill. Looks like we have all. Basically, they're giving us. Ways to gather allies. Weaponry. Totally belonging to the gnolls. Uh, I mean, uh, kobolds. It would be great if we could get some allies out of them. Not just kill them all. Ooh, there's quite a few of them. About a half a dozen. One or two on top of that. Nah, uh, Nafili. You are not going to hurt us, is you? We just little come out. We just want us to flee in as the gnolls. I want some questions answered first. Me answers anything. What you want to know? What do you know about these gnolls? and hairy and they got lots uh, they got bad breath what else mm, nothing we cobbles never fights with gnolls before he not knows why they comes and attack us on his who are you and how did you get here uh, we hit some at a raid on Cuban village and gnolls attack lots of cobbles die or runs but we get captured they going to eat us for sure. You were part of the raid on Hilltop. Ah, uh, yes, you are. You not lives in human village, do you? Tell me why you raided Hilltop. Well, I know why they raided. What happened to Drogon's artifacts? No. What kind of poison did you use on Drogon? Me not know. Master gives Urko a batic knife to hurt dwarf with. He says it get, get got special poison. But Urko flee battle with Nulls. Uh, he not here. Oh. What happened to the artifacts? Well, we only got one item when Nulls takes us prisoner. Big dragon tooth, but Nulls takes it away a long time ago. We not know what happens to the rest of the items. Other kobolds bleed with them maybe, or maybe Nulls cut them all. Hmm. Yes, yes. Do you kobolds know how to fight? Uh, we know how to fight a little bit. Sure, but we got 
do we not got weapons, why you ask? I think you should help me fight the gnolls. We helped you fight gnolls? That not goes well first time we tries. Don't you want to fight back? You just need to help me. Helps you fight gnolls? Okay. We helps you. We fight good, we will. There be door just down passage that go to gnoll chieftain room. Once you start fight, we run over us and helps you fight chieftain. We does that, you get uh, lets us leave. Uh, and where are you going to get to get weapons? We sneaks around. Well, there cuts to be something around here. We'll be fine. Very well. You help me fight the chieftain, and you live. Okay. So we start to look around for weapons and stuff. If you open the door to chieftain room, we comes running when you start big fight. Ah, uh, I'm so sick of kobolds. Could we not just kill them and be done with it? Uh, just so you know, me thinks that door only open from Chieftain's side, but me be sure you figures out way somehow. Until you start fight with Chieftain, we wait. You goes with good luck. You know? Might as well pick a fight now, we have bears and kobolds. Although, how reliable those kobolds are is uh, certainly a question mark. So, the only access, uh, I mean entrance, we can enter that chieftain's room is here. And we'll need to let the kobolds in. I'll try to heal the bear too. So, we're in fairly good shape now. Hopefully they'll do most of the dying. Yep. Get the bears in here. Hopefully they'll at least buy time and we can get the gobbles to join in. Right. I'm definitely picking a fight though, no matter what. Chief Grishnak. Grishnak, say hold. You come no further. We speak now, not fight. Why you come here, fearless one? <sighs> You kill many gnolls of tribe. Why? What do you see? Um. I'm looking for some artifacts that were stolen from Hilltop. Ah, you see the items of power are taken by the little creatures you call kobolds, yes? The mistress uh, Jina seeks them as well. This is why she commanded Krishna to send his gnolls to attack the kobolds and take them. Who is this Jina you speak of? Jina has great power, much magic. She come to the gnoll caves two moons ago and drive out old chieftain. Nashek. He flees with many gnolls and Jinnah commands caves now. She is not gnoll. She spends all time down in ruins beneath gnoll caves, digging. She kills gnolls who disobey. We not want her here. We gladly try to kill her, but Jinnah is too strong. Her magic too strong. We gnolls need help. 
if she be killed. So, allies, allies, allies. Um, uh, it would be stupid of me to uh, not accept help. But that will mean we're not gonna kill these guys, so... But whatever. Are you saying you'd help me fight her? I suggest that if you begin the fight against Yudina, and only if, then Tribe of Gnolls could fight alongside you. I am not sure we can trust you, but we do want Yudina gone from caves. Hmm. If you help me, I will fight her. Then you may pass through our cave safely, fearless one. And should you strike against Yuna, we will be there to help you. I will give you the key you will need to open great doors in the back of this chamber. They lead down to ancient ruins there, where Yuna really lies. I warn you, however, from this point on, you cannot steal more from us. You not touch our slaves, and you not attack us, or there is no deal. Well, could we uh, order those things out first? Okay, from my point of view, it makes more sense to try to move forward with everyone's aid still backing us. And once we've gotten what we want from this place, then we can worry about looting things further, maybe taking out more nulls, things like that. At the moment, we can use all the allies. Okay. Depending on how high level Dina is, uh, four or fourth or fifth level. Rogue slash sorcerer barbarian combo is going to struggle quite a bit, so we can have uh, extra cannon fodder or, or or anything there to help us. It would drastically improve our chances. So lower level. Also guarantee free passage through these areas, so... A strong rope dangles down into the darkness 